Hi Scorpio, it's L here to do your oracle reading. Uh, thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. Okay, so Scorpio, you got some really good cards. You got new love showing up for you. You have true love showing up for you. So you could just be truly happy. Experiencing some happy times, some fun times. You've got brunette, brunette female showing up. This could be you. Or this could be the other woman. There is kind of more like a third party situation going on here. Whether it's you, a woman, and two men. Or it is, a, you know, a man and two women. Or whatever your um, sexual orientation is. But there's a triangle here. Um, we have... Uh, for some of you, it's like a breakup. It, uh, the breakup has already happened or is happening is go you going through it you could have someone pining over you Scorpio uh, wanting to be back with you mourning the relationship needing to accept that you know the relationship is at a loss now um, they're really really sad here um, but we also have, I don't know if this is the same man or, or some of you are dealing with a man who gives you money. He also could be the homeowner or a homeowner. Um, maybe the, the owner of the home that you live in or something about homes or whatnot. Um, something about you making money with this man. Um, or you're a man who makes money uh, with, your, with your mistress or something of that nature. There's also like a blending of, of a family here because there's a breakup and then there's like a, a new love coming in that could cause some conflict, some uh, friction in the connection already. Someone, this could be you Scorpio or, or the other person, someone is saying, I have found the one that my soul loves. So um, some of you feel like you found your soulmate. Yeah, I think you can see it now. Okay, yeah. Some of you feel like you have found your soulmate here. Uh, which is always good. Um, but there's also an energy of the relationship dynamic change in here. Uh, somebody is entering the connection that's bringing about conflict. Maybe with a person who is on the outside of the connection. Because we have another man here, a lover here who's in love, this could be the man that you're asking about Scorpio, or this could be you, Scorpio, you're in love with someone. Um, I don't know if you're trying to be conceited or somebody's conceited and trying to lord over you, Scorpio, or you, them, um, because they have, you know, more obligation or they're their boss, their teacher, their homeowner, their this or their that. Well, we have that energy here. Um, it looks like some of you, there could be somebody who wants you back. It looks like you've come to a place of what religion and spirituality, religion and spirituality of understanding that this relationship is over. You feel differently. Um, you, you possibly don't want it back. You know that you need to do something for yourself. You need to choose you and what you really want. Um, there's somebody here who is full of drama and fear because of their root chakra. Now, the root chakra talks about security and your firm foundation or your foundation or what you've built everything on. And maybe somebody is full of drama and fear because there's someone else funding their security. There's someone else here who is um, making sure another individual is secure. And they feel like they have to walk on eggshells with this person or... At any time or at any given time, they can withdraw their money or their security. And so maybe you, Scorpio, or the other person is full of drama and fear, or this is you being full of fear of not knowing, you know, if if you will have enough money or this person will give you money or, or they will provide security for you or you are unsure about your own security, uh, Scorpio. You don't know if um, you will have security for yourself. Um... There could be a new person, once again, entering your life, or they have already entered. This could be in the future. There's definitely a man here 
with an inability to cope with, with change and with how the situation has changed. Maybe they no longer have access to you or access to the relationship. I don't know. Um, but they're very sad. They're very, they're mourning the loss of maybe their whole life has changed um, with you being gone or, or vice versa. This is how you feel about them. But there's someone who can't get over the fact that it's over. The cards also want you to release your negative thoughts, your crown chakra. So whatever you're thinking about, you need to release that um, because, you know, your thoughts then become your reality. Um, so you, you always want to make sure you're kind of thinking positive. You think negative, think five positive thoughts after that one negative thought. Just have to kind of, you know, refocus and train yourself. It's easier said than done, but, you know, it's work. And um, just try to work on that. Um, some of you have been very dramatic or somebody's been very dramatic here because a fear of, their, of them, them losing their foundation is gone they don't have their security maybe of their family or their wife or their kids or whatever um, so they're just full of drama and that could be you or the other person um, there's definitely another person here um, there's a triangle um, there's also some man with some, you know, fancy car here. He's got some money, but this might be short term, okay? Um, or he has short term relationships here. He could communicate with you about the children. If this was an ex, this is an ex, or this is someone you have children with. He's running around town, you know, in his fancy sports car, flashing his money, spending money having short-term relationships he communicates with you about the children there's also another woman here in his life maybe that he has a child by there's a need for you to have a makeover um scorpio to put yourself back out there with body changes this card specifically talks about a makeover and this card talks about wallflower talks about you know you're not dressing up you're not engaging in in life and you know getting out there get out there as much as possible or do no COVID but don't let that oh wow and then also self care here um and if you're having some health care issues I don't know it, it could be um at the base so it could be um something on in your pelvic area or if you're having pain there um or it's pelvic stomach type area health care change get a second third opinion here um, but definitely some self-care needs to be taken here. Um, this person isn't over you. I think you've had several different readings of somebody just not being over you. Can't get on. Can't move on. Doesn't want to move on. Um, and maybe you stripped them of their, their security, their foundation. So now they're full of drama and fear. All right, Scorpio, if you feel like this reading resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below, paper your question, and receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. Also, um, you could donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so. All links are below. Thank you, Scorpio. Take care.